Hey guys. Please subscribe my YouTube channel. Today I will tell you, history of ancient site, Bagan, located in region of Myanmar. So move toward my today's video. Bagan, also known as Pagan, is an ancient city, located in the Mandalay region of Myanmar, Burma. It was the capital of the Pagan Kingdom, from the 9th, to the 13th centuries, and is renowned for its, vast archaeological site featuring, thousands of well-preserved pagodas, and temples. Here's a comprehensive history of Bagan. Early History Bagan's history can be traced, back to the 2nd century AD, but it rose to prominence, in the 9th century, when King Anurata, unified the region and established, the First Burmese Empire. Rise of Bagan. Bagan became the capital of the pagan kingdom, in the 9th century. The city grew rapidly, and under subsequent rulers, it became a major center of, Theravada Buddhism, and a hub for religious and cultural activities. Prolific Builders. The rulers of Bagan, were prolific builders, and each successive king contributed, to the construction of temples, and pagodas. The city reached its architectural zenith, under King Anurata, King Kyansitha, and King Sithu I. Diverse Architectural Styles Bagan, showcases a diverse range of architectural styles, influenced by Indian, Mon, and Burmese traditions. The temples vary in size, and design, from small shrines, to towering pagodas. Ananda Temple The Ananda Temple, is one of the most revered, and well-preserved temples in, Bagan. Built in 1105 AD, it is known for its symmetrical design, and exquisite artwork. The temple houses, four standing Buddha images. Cave Temples of Bagan. In addition to freestanding temples, Bagan, also features cave temples, carved into the cliffs along the Irrawaddy River. These cave temples, such as, the Kyak Guyu Min, provide a unique architectural variation. Hot Air Balloon Rides. Bagan, is famous for its breathtaking sunrise, and sunset views. And one popular way to experience them is, by taking a hot air balloon ride. This offers a unique perspective, of the vast temple plains. Bagan Nat Festival. The Bagan Nat Festival, held annually, celebrates the spirits, or Nats believed to inhabit the area. The festival includes, traditional performances, dances, and religious ceremonies. Economic Prosperity. Bagan thrived economically through trade, and agriculture. The Irrawaddy River, facilitated transportation and trade, contributing to the city's prosperity. Burmese Script Inscriptions. Many of the temples in Bagan, feature inscriptions in the Burmese script, that provide historical and religious information, contributing to the understanding, of the region's history. Bagan Archaeological Museum. The Bagan Archaeological Museum, houses a rich collection of artifacts. Including, sculptures, pottery, and religious objects, from the Bagan period. It provides insights into the art, and culture of the ancient city. Rediscovery. Bagan, remained largely forgotten until, the 19th century, when British colonial officials, began to take an interest in its historical, and archaeological significance. UNESCO World Heritage Site. In 2019, Bagan, was designated as, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Recognizing its exceptional cultural, and historical value. The site includes over, 2,200, well-preserved temples, and pagodas. Earthquake damage, and restoration. Bagan, suffered significant damage, from earthquakes in, 1975, and 2016. Efforts have been made to restore, and preserve the ancient structures. And some of the damaged temples, have been reconstructed. Modern Tourism. Bagan, has become a major tourist destination. Attracting visitors from around the world, who come to marvel at its ancient temples, and experience its rich cultural heritage. Bagan, stands as a testament to the architectural, and cultural achievements, of the ancient Burmese civilization. The site continues to captivate, historians, archaeologists, and tourists, offering a glimpse, into the region's glorious past. If you enjoyed today's video, then like and share my today's video, and subscribe my YouTube channel.